On the morning of July 11, 2022, NASA unveiled the first images captured by the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, a groundbreaking instrument hailed as the most powerful space telescope ever built. Named after NASA's second administrator, the JWST underwent an extensive 26-year development process. The time, effort and resources invested by NASA have already been rewarded with extraordinary discoveries. The images from the JWST are steadily unveiling information that challenges our current understanding of the universe. Among the first significant achievements of the telescope was capturing light from the SMX0723 galaxy cluster, located 5.12 billion light-years away in the southern part of the Pisces constellation. This region of the sky, visible from Earth's southern hemisphere, is frequently observed by the Hubble Space Telescope and others, all seeking to understand the early history of the universe. The initial data is of tremendous importance, offering a glimpse into the structure of the universe just 600 million years after the Big Bang. This discovery is only the beginning. The JWST has the potential to reveal even more about the formation of stars and planets, the behavior of black holes, and the possibility of extraterrestrial life. The latest data has already exceeded expectations. The telescope has uncovered over 700 galaxies near the edge of the observable universe, and the infrared light captured has prompted many established scientists to rethink their models of the early universe. Could humanity be ready to reshape its cosmological understanding based on these astonishing new findings? Only time will tell. As Kenneth Sembach, director of the Space Telescope Science Institute, remarked, Today's cosmic mysteries are slowly revealing themselves, and our comprehension of the universe will forever be altered. So, what exactly has the JWST discovered? The data reveals groundbreaking information that could redefine our understanding of the universe's origins. Among the 700 galaxies observed by the JWST, six stand out as potential game-changers, capable of challenging the widely accepted theory of galaxy formation. These newly discovered galaxies are approximately 13.5 billion years old, containing vast numbers of stars with masses similar to that of our Sun, and they form just 500 to 700 million years after the Big Bang. This suggests they are comparable in size to our own Milky Way galaxy, which contradicts most models of early galaxy development. A study published on February 22 in Nature revealed that these galaxies are so massive that they defy conventional expectations for early galaxies in the universe. Current theory suggests that galaxies begin as small clouds of interstellar gas and dust and gradually grow over time, but these discoveries suggest a different narrative. Joel Scholf, an assistant professor of cosmology and astronomy at Penn State University and co-author of the study, noted that these findings cast doubt on the conventional understanding of galaxy formation. The six galaxies discovered by the JWST are not the oldest observed by the telescope. In fact, just last year, scientists made a remarkable discovery of four galaxies that date back only about 350 million years after the Big Bang. Despite their great age, these galaxies were much smaller than the newly found ones. The discovery of these earlier galaxies provided vital insights into the universe's development during a period close to its inception. Dr. Emma Chapman, an astrophysicist at the University of Nottingham, emphasized the need for continued observations before drawing definitive conclusions about the early universe. While these new galaxies are fascinating, more data is required to fully understand their implications. The research team is well aware of this need and plans to employ additional observational techniques to refine their findings. One key method being utilized is spectroscopy, which allows researchers to analyze the light emitted or absorbed by objects in space. By studying the spectra of light from these galaxies, scientists can determine various properties, such as their age, composition, and mass. This technique is crucial for providing more accurate and detailed information about the newly discovered galaxies. Spectroscopic analysis will help scientists better estimate the age of these six galaxies, an important factor in reconstructing the timeline of cosmic evolution. Understanding the precise age of a galaxy is essential for mapping the development of the universe. Additionally, the size and mass of these galaxies are critical factors. By determining these properties more accurately, researchers can compare them to existing models of galaxy formation and evolution. This comparison will help assess whether these models need to be revised in light of the new discoveries.
The research team's plan to gather spectroscopic images is an important step toward addressing some of the uncertainties raised by the new findings. If these galaxies are indeed as large and massive as current data suggests, it could force a reconsideration of the prevailing theories about how galaxies formed and evolved in the early universe. The current models typically propose that galaxies started small and grew over time, but the immense size of these newly discovered galaxies could indicate a different process. Further observations and analysis will be crucial in either confirming or revising current models. The scientific community is eager to see how these discoveries will affect our understanding of the early universe. By studying these six galaxies in greater detail, researchers hope to shed light on the mysteries of cosmic evolution and the formation of the universe as we know it. A significant advancement in the study of cosmic development has revealed that the structures we observe in nearby spiral galaxies and in our Milky Way might have existed as far back as 12 billion years ago. This discovery is truly remarkable, as it allows us to broaden our understanding of the universe. New research suggests that stars and galaxies may have evolved in ways that were more complex than previously thought. For instance, the presence of certain elements in these ancient galaxies indicates that the processes of star formation might have been more advanced and intricate in the early universe than we had assumed. By studying these early galaxies and their chemical compositions, we can gain deeper insights into the conditions that led to the birth of stars and galaxies. Each new discovery pushes the boundaries of our knowledge and reshapes our understanding of cosmic history. As we delve further into the depths of space revealed by the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, new questions arise about the nature of these early galaxies and their role in shaping our understanding of universal evolution. The unparalleled resolution and sensitivity of the JWST provide an exceptional vantage point, offering insights that were once out of reach. With every new discovery, cosmologists are faced with challenges to existing theories and models, prompting them to rethink long-held assumptions about the universe's origins. One particularly intriguing area of study is the role of cosmic dust in the formation and evolution of galaxies. Observations from the JWST suggest that cosmic dust may have played a much larger role in shaping the early universe than previously realized. Dust is crucial in cooling the gas within galaxies, which is essential for the formation of stars and planetary systems. Understanding how dust accumulated in these ancient galaxies could offer valuable clues about the processes that influenced their development. Another exciting aspect of JWST's findings is the potential detection of early black holes. These hypothetical black holes could have formed shortly after the Big Bang and may help explain some of the anomalies that current models struggle to account for. If these early black holes were more common than previously thought, they could have had a profound impact on the formation of galaxies and stars, reshaping our understanding of cosmic development. The study of high redshift galaxies, those observed at vast distances corresponding to earlier periods of the universe's history, is also providing new insights into the rapid formation of structures in the universe. Recent discoveries suggest that some of these high redshift galaxies formed much earlier than current models had predicted. This challenges previous theories that proposed a slower, more gradual evolution of cosmic structures. By examining the properties of these ancient galaxies, scientists hope to refine their models and develop a more accurate timeline of cosmic evolution. Additionally, JWST's observations of distant galaxy clusters, the largest gravitationally bound structures in the universe, are offering new insights into the large-scale structure of the cosmos. These clusters serve as cosmic laboratories for studying the interactions between dark matter, dark energy, and ordinary matter. Understanding how these clusters formed and evolved over time could help scientists better grasp the nature of dark matter and dark energy, which together account for about 95% of the universe's total mass energy content. JWST's infrared capabilities have also enabled the detection of some of the earliest known stars, known as Population 3 stars. These stars, which formed from primordial hydrogen and helium, are believed to be the first to light up the universe. Studying these ancient stars provides important information about the early stages of star formation and the subsequent enrichment of the interstellar medium with heavier elements. This process played a crucial role in shaping the chemical makeup of the universe, the formation of planets, and the emergence of life as we know it. Furthermore, JWST's spectroscopic data is shedding light on the chemical compositions of exoplanet atmospheres. 
By analyzing the light from distant exoplanets as it passes through their atmospheres, scientists can detect the presence of molecules such as water vapor, carbon dioxide, and methane. This information is critical for assessing the habitability of exoplanets and understanding the conditions that might support life beyond our solar system. The ability to study exoplanet atmospheres in greater detail could significantly advance the search for extraterrestrial life. In summary, the James Webb Space Telescope is revolutionizing our understanding of the universe, expanding our knowledge in numerous ways. From uncovering ancient galaxies and stars to exploring the complexities of cosmic dust, early black holes, and exoplanet atmospheres, JWST's observations are prompting a re-evaluation of existing theories and models. As astronomers continue to analyze the data and interpret these discoveries, the implications for our understanding of cosmic history and the fundamental processes shaping the universe are profound and far-reaching. Specialists are eager to delve deeper into the circumstances and processes that led to the development of the six newly discovered galaxies. While these galaxies are not the oldest observed by the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, their size and mass offer fresh insights that may challenge existing theories. Ongoing research and spectroscopic analysis will be essential for refining our understanding of galaxy formation and evolution. As scientists continue to study these galaxies, they are likely to uncover more about the early moments of the universe and contribute to a deeper comprehension of cosmic history. Could our understanding of star and galaxy formation change? Until now, the process of star and galaxy formation has remained shrouded in mystery. Erica Nelson, an astronomer at the University of Colorado Boulder, explains that the Milky Way produces one to two new stars annually. In contrast, some of the 700 objects observed by JWST may generate hundreds of new stars each year and span the entire universe. If these findings are confirmed, they could significantly advance our exploration and rethinking of the cosmos. We cannot rule out the possibility that these galaxies might harbor quasars or supermassive black holes. The new infrared images obtained by JWST will require further analysis to explore this. According to a study published in Nature in June 2023, scientists using JWST have discovered a cloud of complex organic molecules within the galaxy SPT0418D47, located 12.3 billion light-years away. These are the oldest known organic molecules ever detected by humans. Spectroscopic data reveals that these molecules belong to complex structures, mainly polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons, PAHs. On Earth, PAHs are found in substances like forest fire smoke and vehicle exhaust fumes, and in space, they may play a vital role in star formation. Researchers hypothesize that PAHs might have regulated the temperature of gas clouds in star-forming regions, influencing the timing and location of star development. PAHs are considered fundamental building blocks for some of the longest-lasting forms of life on Earth. The discovery that these organic molecules existed in the early universe, just one billion years after the Big Bang, raises intriguing questions that no cosmological model has yet addressed. Joaquin Vieira, a co-author of the study from the University of Illinois Urbana-Champaign, expressed surprise at this revelation, noting it provides new insights into the complex chemical interactions occurring in early galaxies in the nascent universe. The discovery of these intricate organic molecules at such a great distance is a major breakthrough. Humanity first became aware of the SPT-0418, D47 galaxy in 2020 through the South Pole Telescope of the National Science Foundation. The mass of the stars in this galaxy could be determined through a physical phenomenon called gravitational lensing, where light from a distant object is bent around a nearby massive object due to its gravitational pull. This effect causes the light to be distorted and amplified. For SPT-0418, D47, Researchers calculated that it appeared over 30 times brighter during light investigations. Initial findings revealed that SPT-0418 D47 contained a significant amount of heavy elements, but the South Pole Telescope lacked the frequency range to clearly observe its carbon-containing organic molecules. Thanks to JWST, everything is much clearer now. Justin Spilker, an astronomer at Texas A&M University and the lead author of the study, stated that everywhere they look, they see molecules linked to star formation. This supports the theory that organic molecules play a role in star formation. However, one mystery still remains. 
the uneven distribution of PAH cloud densities, which continues to be an unanswered question. SPT 0418D47 also shares some similarities with our own Milky Way galaxy, which is unusual for an ancient galaxy. Galaxies from the early universe are typically thought to have distinct shapes compared to those observed today. Francesca Rizzo, a research astronomer at the Max Planck Institute for Astronomy in Germany, remarked that this discovery challenges our understanding of the evolution of galaxies and their structures in the early universe.